Hello students. Today we are going to discuss different types of resonating structures. In the last class already we have discussed that the, uh, what is resonance and what is the condition of resonance. And uh, today we will discuss some important resonating structures and their stability as per the conditions we will discuss. So let us start from here that uh, This, this is called vinyl alcohol. This structure is called vinyl alcohol. If you see the resonance, resonance means you have to delocalize the phi electrons. If number of delocalization is more, then the number of resonating structure will be more. That means if number of pi bond conjugation are more, then number of resonance also more. Conjugation means just uh, Double bond will be alternately, alternatively placed. Single bond and double bond like this. So here, as oxygen having lone pair, the resonance will be like this. Okay. So what is the resonating structure? This is the symbol of resonance. Now CS2 minus, then single bond CH, double bond. OH plus because electron lone pair removed from oxygen that's oxygen. Now you see the difference. I will tell you the points also. Here this structure one and structure two if you compare it is less stable. Why it is less stable? Because charge separation. Charge separation takes place means your stability will be less. So Structure 1 is more stable than structure 2. This is the one important resonance. And uh, here, due to resonance, you see the single bond becomes double bond. That's why this double bond, you see the uh, reactivity of C oxygen, carbon oxygen bond decreases due to formation of double bond here, formation of single bond. Okay, then this resonance structure can be written this is 1 3 butyl i 1 3 butyl i if this if you see the resonance structure of 1 3 butyl i then you start from here okay if it will be from this carbon atom then it will be cs2 plus Single bond CH minus, then single bond CH2, CH2. If you do another resonating structures by doing this way, in this way you do, then structure will be CH2 plus single bond CH double bond. CH single bond CH2 minus structure 1, structure 2, structure 3. If you compare the stability, if you compare the stability of structure 1 and 2 and 3, here charge separation is more. More charge separation means if the gap between the opposite charge is more, means stability is less. So compared to stability order. This is the most stable. Most stable is first one. First one is most stable structure. Then which will come second structure. Then third structure. This is the stability order. Stability order first structure because no charge separation. More stable. Okay. Gap is less. Stability will be more. If gap is more, stability will be less so in this way so this is the stability if you draw the structure phenol structure this is the aromatic compounds I mean phenol phenol resonance will be starting from lone pair then first structure will be like this minus double bond OS plus 
and then like this. Then second structure will be rotated like this. If you do like this, then it will be move like this. Different type of structure is possible. Even you see the structure one, structure two, structure three. If you do it, if compare this one, structure one and two, one, two and three. If you compare here, it has no charge separation. So first structure is more stable than second structure, more stable than third structure. Because third structure charge separation is more. Fast structure charge separation is less, and it has no charge separation, more stable. So this is regarding the stability or not. Then the fourth one also you can do the phenolate ion structure of phenolate ion. This is the phenolate ion structure. You can do in this way fast structure. Double bond O, then minus like this. Again, you do it. Now it is minus such. Then double bond, double bond, double bond O. Then like this, you also do another structure like this. So here, if you see. Uh, phenol structure and phenol ion structure. If you see, phenol has charge separation due to resonance. Charge separation takes place. That's why stability is decreases. But here, same minus charge, same minus charge is delocalizing from oxygen to carbon. Then next carbon like this. The negative charge is delocalized. Delocalization negative charge means stability generally increases. But here, delocalization takes place. But what happens? So charge separation observed. If charge separation is there, already we have discussed in the last day that uh, videos that uh, uh, if there is a charge separation, then stability decreases. Remember, all resulting structures are not equally stable. All resulting structure are not equal stable, but each structure has contribution towards the stability of resonance hybrid. Already I have told you, resonance hybrid is the most stable structure, hypothetical structure. It is the combine of all resulting structures. So these structures have some stability, but they are not equal stable. So what if you see? Uh, if you compare phenol and phenol ion, this structure is less stable than this structure. Stability, if you compare, as the, the okay, phenol is more stable. Phenol is this structure. This structure, if you compare other structure, it is more stable. But if you compare phenol and phenol ion, this minus charge is delocalized. That's why this is the stable form. And this form, if you will see charge separation takes place, that's why stability decreases. Then this negative charge is delocalized from oxygen to carbon, that's why stability increases. Okay, this is regarding phenol and phenolate ion, one three beta ionic and vinyl alpha. This is called vinyl alpha. If you do this structure. This structure, this is called acetal ion. If you see the resonance of this resonance of acetal ion, it will be C H three, C single minus double bond O. Structure one and structure two. We here structure one and two is are equivalent and equally stable. So just to see. Carbon double bond O, single bond O minus. Here also single bond O minus means equal. This this CO minus CO minus structure is equivalent. That's why one structure, second structure, both are equally stable, and it is the most stable, more stable structure due to equivalent resonance. 
if molecule has equivalence resonance it is more stable then if you, you see phenolic ion has also resonance but phenolic ion this resonance structure is not equivalent because all are not identical but these two structure are identical that's why called that is that is why it is called equivalent resonance and it has equivalent resonance so it is more stable than which one phenolic ion that means acetate ion is more stable than phenolic ion due to equivalence resonance if we draw If the structure is like this, CS two minus CS double bond O, its resonance will be towards oxygen. Movement of fire from will be towards oxygen. The result is CS two double bond CH O minus. Clear? Then here indicates just you see negative charge is delocalized. Negative charge is delocalized. Here negative charge is on the carbon but in the second structure it is an oxygen but this second structure is more stable than first structure first structure is less stable than second structure because here in the first structure the negative charge on the carbon which is less electronegative than oxygen which in the net in second structure the negative charge on oxygen the rule is that The electrons should be shifted towards more electronegative atom, and the negative charge should be assigned to the more electronegative atom. That's why, if negative charge remains on oxygen, it will be more stable than negative charge remains on carbon. That's why structure one is less stable than structure two. If you do the resonance of benzene, benzene resonance, if you draw. Step by step, if this is the first structure, it will be then structure will be then structure will be. Then these two structures may be after combination of these two by delocalization, the structure will be like this. So this, if you do, this is the first structure, second structure, third structure, fourth one, and fifth one. This structure, if you see, structure one and fifth has no charge separation. Just to see. So structure one and fifth is also equivalent. The structure one and fifth are equivalent. You see no difference. Equivalent structure, but the position of double bond are different. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. If you see position of double bond different, but these are equivalent. So structure one and fifth directly you can say equivalent resonance. Structure two, three, and four are not equivalent because the position is different. Here, plus minus is very close, so more stable. So, structure one is equivalent to structure fifth. Equivalent. Then this structure is more stable than next charge separation. Next charge separation is structure two. Structure two is equivalent to which one? Structure four. Structure one, structure uh, structure two and four almost equivalent. 
then st structure second and structure second and structure four equal and structure third is least scalar because char separation is more. So this is regarding some region, different types of resonance and also stability. If you draw the resonance of If it has also resonance, it will be towards oxygen because oxygen is more electronegative, electron will be shifted towards oxygen because due to delocalization. So first structure will be after delocation CO minus CH double bond, then plus like this, the next structure will be Shifting of electron in this way that here double bond here plus then double bond C O minus H is structure and if we have a resonance we need plus C no. Okay, these structures here, here it is double one, double one. So like this, again also, another structure is possible, reverse way, the structure will be, you can draw the structure, see double one row, H, then 5 and So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is the structure of benzaldehyde. This is different resonating structures. So different type of structure is possible by delocalization of pi electron. You have to see, we have to follow which condition, which rule uh, to apply the write the different canonical form of particular organic compounds. So you practice, you have to practice for drawing different resonating structures. Then you will have better knowledge regarding the properties of organic compounds. So in the next class, we will discuss the application of resonance. Okay, thank you all.